Look at this. I freaking love this jacket. Thank you, and I freaking love them. Not only is it a matching set, but come on. Oh, who is she? There's the best thing in the world, okay? <laughs> Say hello to my gray hair. It is my favorite time of the year. Fall. It doesn't get that cold down here during the fall. We're still gonna dress for the occasion, okay? And I am ready for fall. Y'all don't understand how much I love fall fashion. Like fall is the best thing. You can layer so many pieces and look so much more put together. Like just, it's just my favorite. And then the colors for fall are amazing and things like that. Anyways. Let's just get into it. First, we're gonna talk about cardigans. Cardigans is like one of the major pieces for fall. It just it just puts an outfit together like a basic tank top and jeans and then just throw on a cardigan and things like that. But there are different types of cardigans. There's the long one, the oversized, and even the cardigan sets. And that's literally the three I'm gonna show you. So first, let me show you the cardigan set. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Not only is it a matching set, but come on, you have the top and this, all you have to do is find the bottoms, literally. And let's say you don't want to wear it with this top, you can literally wear whatever top you want and just throw this over that. Like this set is just so nice. Same with this, you could wear this and then switch out the top or again, you could wear it together. It's just very well put together. It's only like obviously a cropped type so it's only the top it's not a whole oversized or like the other ones i'm about to show you you see she's like cute and adorable i don't know very i don't know very put together and stuff but again if this isn't your style it is okay there are many other cardigans out there many different ones this is just one idea of course before we continue everything i'm about to show you does not mean you have to go out and buy every little thing and everything you see here it may be an essential for me and many others but if it's not your style don't get it because then it's gonna end up in your closet all the way in the back burner just because you were like oh okay but as i said we gonna wear it and no you don't have to so yeah so just like a little disclaimer moment that's not even a disclaimer right you know what i mean then we have the super long cardigan which i wish i could show you here this is how long it is i literally have to stand back here but you see how cute it is and then even this little detail right here oh my gosh i freaking love i obviously left the other top on from the cardigan set but these oh my gosh i love so much because with like let's say you wear a pair of heels it just flows so well even with heeled boots it looks so good it flows makes you look not longer but kind of well this could go wrong or right but it is so pretty it is such a different look than just the little cardigan one and then third still in the cardigan section is an oversized cardigan so here i have this one and look at it it is super oversized now for something like this obviously for my body type i would not wear so much flowy stuff i would wear a lot of tight 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 stuff and then throw this over it because it is so oversized that sometimes oversized things can play a very very bad role in what you're wearing literally sometimes you would just look too bulky which if you're going for that look don't get me wrong go for it i'm all for Whatever anyone, whatever your style is, is fine. I personally do not look, do not like to look super bulky. Like obviously an oversized is already gonna give you a little bit of that bulkiness. I like my figure to show a lot, if that makes sense. So I just need to wear it very tight. Okay, you see how this is a lot bulkier than the other two? Like this is for sure oversized, oversized, but it's still cute, very casual, but put together. And obviously you could throw in some jewelry and things like that and be done. It is another little thing to put over your outfits and look much more put together. And yeah, next, my most favorite one. My most, 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 most favorite, I guess you could say trend in this fall. Or it was even last fall and i think it's gonna ride over for a few i don't know years i feel leather everything literally 
let's talk about them. okay first off we're gonna go with the jacket out of any leather piece i feel like a jacket is gonna be great for your wardrobe look at this i freaking love this jacket but a leather jacket will literally put your outfit so well together ah i freaking love this jacket jacket you see oh my gosh it is like a little bit on the oversized section but and of course since we're still in the leather you need some leather pants as well just do and don't get me wrong now more than last year i feel like color and leather pants well these are pleather i don't know what do you call the fake leather whatever you know what i'm talking about leather pants these leather pants are now in every color you could think of right now if you don't like black you do not have to stick to black anymore you never did really but there's so many other there's literally beige ones color ones all you need is some leather pants it is such a great staple right now i'd say they're super flattering and cute and i freaking love them and of course next is a leather top yes you do not have to get one exactly like this this is super revealing even for me but if you like revealing hey get this but imagine an all leather outfit that's literally what i'm gonna do with the three pieces that i just showed you i will literally throw on a lot of leather like especially all leather outfits are super super are gonna be super in right now and i am living for it like i love it i love it i love it i freaking love the look of it it just makes you i feel like it makes you look so much put so much more put together here's the top you see what i mean by super revealing but it's okay and then all leather look like oh, i am in love i love it and still staying in the topic of leather this is what i'm talking about color now i ain't gonna lie to y'all this skirt so yes get a leather skirt also it is a beautiful it is the color i live for for blue a lot and i really love this leather skirt now let me tell y'all something about this leather skirt i thrifted it okay and it is gorgeous but guess what it don't fit me because <laughs> my behind is rude sometimes it literally won't go down this it'll probably fit through here probably not but i just had to show it to y'all okay even even if it doesn't fit me because i'm literally holding on to this skirt to hope one day it fits me which it probably never will some places that sell a lot of leather clothing in colors is aritzia i love aritzia that's definitely one i would recommend and maybe naked um clothing which is n-a-k-d they also might have some but i'm not 100 percent sure and i'm pretty sure asos and zara and places like that next you need brown in your life okay some people don't like brown and i don't know why brown is so freaking i don't know i don't know what it is but it is so appealing to me literally okay let's start with this one literally i got this one years ago like maybe four to five years ago before brown was actually hitting hitting like right in the verge of hitting and i don't like my jacket that much but i freaking love it this is more like a chocolate brown clearly if you could get a brown jacket and actually it doesn't even have to be brown just brown whatever you like here is this one you see what i mean by the half sleeve like it'll show your long sleeve for your arms and things like that but it's cute then we have a dress here a brown dress this is more of a darker brown clearly you can see so even in a dress you can easily dress up with heels or dress down with a pair of sneakers and things like that and i have another dress here another one it's more like cottage girl plus utility i don't know don't quote me on that but literally just get brown and whatever you think will be appealing to you it could be a pair of pants it could be a pair of top a pair of top it's not even a thing right it could be a top it could be actually a cardigan set they have those it could be a cardigan could be even shoes anything but brown is definitely gonna be a such a beautiful color this fall 
I already thought it was beautiful, okay, before y'all made it a thing, but whatever. Next, I am dragging the button down, button ups, button downs this fall. I'm bringing them with me. I literally wore button ups during this whole summer. And yes, it was hot, but I freaking love them. They just put an outfit together, like, it just make it, makes it look more put together, and I love that. So, yes, we have a regular white one or whatever color you love. It's great and everything, but then we have this one, which is more of a, would you say, linen look? I don't know, but this one was my favorite, and it was cropped, and I think I wore this one more than this one. Okay, here is the white one, which is super cute, right? Like, I love it. It's still good, but let me show you the other one. Okay, here it is. You see, like it's just a different vibe. It's a different look. Like they're both so cute. It's just so, not so different, but kind of, yeah. <laughs> of course, the long sleeve tops could not be left out. Now, don't get me wrong. I know not everyone likes a turtle neck, but I'm gonna tell y'all why I love a turtle neck. Turtle necks are so good. Like. It just stands out a little bit more and you stay warmer. <laughs> Clearly, Vanessa does not need to stay warm in such a hot state, but sh she wanna stay extra warmer, okay? So it is so nice because when you throw on a little sweater or something, it just stands out and it gives the outfit a little bit like a, like a oomph, you know? But that's why I love turtlenecks. Now, obviously the other option is not as such a turtleneck it just stands like right here so just like a you know basic yeah i mean pretty much it could be black it could be any other colors you like definitely if you like to wear a lot of color make sure you get some more colorful ones if you like neutrals get neutrals if you like black then get black ones this one's a bodysuit type they sell these in bodysuit types so Vice versa, whatever is better for you, it doesn't matter as long as you are comfortable and you feel confident and great. Okay, so as you can see, this one is like a super turtleneck, like literally choking type of thing, and I'm super warm. And I just tucked it in, like, because it looked more flattering that way. And like I was telling y'all how throwing on something will add a detail to this. So I'm just throwing this on, and as you can see, like, this is just a part of the detail. Oh my God, I'm never gonna get over this. I've had this for so long and I always love this. It kinda is turtle neckish after all, but not as much as the other one. Next, a pair of trousers. Again, it could be any color. Personally, I really think a beige one, you really need one, a beige one, a tan one, a neutral one basically because you will be able to match so many things with a pair of trousers. Not only can you wear a trouser with a pair of heels, you can also wear them with the combat boots that are gonna be in this year and were last year. Boots, heels, even sneakers, honestly, I would. It, it is a great staple piece for your, for your wardrobe. I mean, there's not much about them. They're just trousers. <laughs> Okay, look at these trousers. They're freaking cute. Obviously, there's so many more other trouser styles, so this is just one of many. Okay, next. Knitted dresses. You need one. It could be any length. This one is, um, I think it's kind of mini, but not really. I think a little bit above your knees, and this one's like a midi, like super, super long. So I have two options here. I got this one, this white one, and it is so freaking cute because I freaking love when they have a little, what do you call, th call this? Well, that, the little cut, you know? It is so beautiful. Oh my gosh, like the things that I could imagine with this, heels, with my booties, with a jacket, with a, oh my gosh, okay. Endless, 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 but any needed dress will do. Oh my gosh. I had forgotten how much I love this dress. Yes, this one I've had for a while. I mean, it's a basic black dress with a little bit of a turtleneck action, but cute. This limbs you so very nice. It's just a basic black knitted dress. So you just need it in your closet, okay? This one's a lot more thicker than the black one. A lot more thicker and so warm. Like I'm already freaking warming up too much. Last but not least, my favorite part. 
matching sets i die for matching sets not only because you could literally match them together but because you could literally i mean like set them apart and wear them differently right and plus okay setting that aside also a matching set looks so well put together you don't have to think much you put it on all you have to think about are the accessories and the shoes and call it a day you don't have to figure out about what type of i want to wear oh my gosh and i can find the pair of pants and blah, 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 right of course you don't have to because you have the matching set but anyways we're gonna talk about two different matching sets one is a sweater matching set yes i freaking love these they're oh, they're the best thing in the world okay yes it's new i literally got this one this year but we have this one it is gorgeous i freaking love it i love this little detail not a lot of them have it some are very basic the basic ones are okay but when you can when it can be an added look i mean obviously it's a plus she is cute af i love it my next favorite set is a rip set yes so this one is the little top with the little ribbed pants and these are amazing not only because I have such wide hips that nothing fits me half the time. I struggle, okay? And I freaking hate it. But, I mean, it's a ribbed, ribbed pants. They're going to stretch. They're going to look flattering. And I love this one. This one, everyone has been loving on my TikTok. And yes, I see why, girls. Because goddamn, this shit is cute as AF. I swear, this set is going to be my favorite for a long time. I'm going to be... Yaki. Yaki tatelo. Pero. Oh, it's good. She's gorgeous. Awesome. One last thing. Shoes. For shoes, I'm pretty sure y'all will know what it's going to be in. But let me still show you. So first off, we have the old combat boots. Yes, you could get the Doc Martens. Mine are not Doc Martens because I know I'm not big into them. I will probably wear them like five times during the year. That's me being honest, but I think they're still so great. They're different colors now. There's beige ones. There's the beige ones I think are more flattering. Obviously, these are more to me look more aggressive, if you could say. So either way, if it's not your style and you think it just doesn't go with you, don't get them. As simple as that. Don't make that mistake. I've done it many times. But yes. Next are an, a little ankle booty. I love these. These fall over your ankle. And I think those look so flattering, especially on me. It may not on you. You know what looks flattering. But any like little booties are freaking cute. I love pointy. It does not mean you have to get pointy. You could get the squared ones. You could get the round ones. The point is... A beautiful leather booty preferably but if not you know whatever rolls your boat is cool but now that we're in the booty section well that's all we're gonna talk about in the same booty yes they're pointy they look very similar no they're not the same brand i think no they're not but a brown ones oh my gosh i think oh like i don't know <laughs> just get some brown ones they're freaking cute and i love them and i don't know what else to say then i love them but yeah, so you need booties, combat boots. Other than that, you know, the regular sneakers, heels, and things like that are still very in. Those are just like the actual fall main things. Same for everything up here. It's just mainly the fall. It does not mean you can't carry on tank tops. It does not mean you can't carry on other things in your wardrobe that were used in summer. No, it does not mean that. Obviously, you know what you have. Mix and match here. Just add a few pieces that you're like, okay, these pieces need to be added to my wardrobe because it'll amp up my fall style that is it i enjoyed doing this video how do people close freaking youtube videos like me personally i'm like okay i don't want to just say bye thank you for watching bye like i wish i could close y'all off by, by just i don't know maybe i'm thinking too much right yeah i'm thinking too much okay bye ends up closing by saying bye even though she said she didn't okay. bye guys i'm tripping i'm tripping <laughs>